Bill Haney said in an interview that um, Devin Haney should be pound for pound or fighter of the year over Terrence Crawford, being that people are saying that Earl Smith was weight drained and that Vasil Lomachenko and Regis Progray were at their best. What's your thoughts on it? It's tough to say. I hate pound for pound. I hate it because everybody has an argument. Everybody definitely has an argument. In your way has an argument. Canelo has an argument. Um, Bud has an argument. Haney has an argument. Everybody, everybody got their points, and it sound good, but it's hard to be like number one. It's hard to, cause what Bud did was amazing. We ain't gonna lie. What Haney did, amazing. What what Inouye did, amazing. Mm -hmm. I mean, so it's like, mm, it's hard to say. You know what I'm saying I can't really pick. I can't really say if he should be number one, two, or three. Because everybody got their points. You know what I'm saying? And that's why I really hate Pound for Pound. But I ain't going to lie, man. Bud was against all odds. He was against all odds. Nobody had Bud beating Smith. Nobody. Even the people that were saying it, they really ain't believe it. You know what I'm saying? So. I can't, I can't so. say that. You you had people that vehemently believe no. that, that Terrence Crawford... All right, so in, in the sense of in the sense of Dev, you know I'm a big Dev guy. I feel like Terrence would be pound for pound, maybe not fighter of the year because he only fought once. Yeah. But pound for pound, simply because number one, he beat another pound for pound guy right. in the fashion that he did, right. along with being undisputed in his second division. Right. That's right. some shit. Four belts. That's never been done. Four right. belt era. That's never been done. Right. So that's what I'm saying. Everybody got an argument. You know what I mean? Anyway. It's tough. It's tough to say. It's tough to say, man. I ain't gonna lie. But Dev definitely has a case. I might with Edge Dev for Fighter of the Year, being that you beat the Sun Lomachenko, then you move up and face one of the top guys at 140. Regis Progray. His, he, for like the last five years, he's been one of the top guys, and he's doing it in good fashion. But see, a lot of this shit with the top guy shit be popularity too. Bud wasn't popular. That's why I keep saying Bud because Bud, those who know, they know. I mean, those who don't know, they, they was lost. I knew that dude was nasty like that. I mean, so when he beat him up like that, I was Wait, wait, they, they, they may say you playing both sides again, G, because you complimenting Bud. No. I had to throw that in there. Yo. Yeah, but I've been saying, I've been saying Bud was on some shit. Um, and when he did what he did, I wasn't surprised because I kept saying it. Say he, he gonna stop him. But it was because I saw what I saw. Dev, though, keeps surprising me. He got somebody, yeah, I mean, I don't, it's tough, man. I ain't gonna lie. It's tough. It's tough to say. Because he's doing his thing, man. I ain't gonna lie.